everyone. We're now coming up on Pirate Point, the fabulous new Happy in the Keys property. It is open water views and just about everything you would want in a property. Five bedrooms, five baths. It's made up of a main house, which we'll go through first, and then two separate small houses with their own suites. Here we go. Enter Pirate Point. You see just how fabulous and inviting it is. You have stunning views, patios everywhere, lots of places to enjoy the outdoors, beautiful furnishings that are perfect spots for everybody to pile in. Um, the kitchen is fully equipped, a gourmet kitchen complete with Keys Cuisine cookbook so you can try out and find new favorite recipes with your day's catch. The grounds are really lovely, two big hammocks that um, are poised to just relax and enjoy the outdoors. Off of the main living room through the kitchen, there's another large living space. It's actually a game room and a bar. So it's another super fun spot to hang out, play games, have drinks, watch a game. Um, it leads out to the pool. We'll go out there in just a little bit. The main room in the main house at Pirate Point is Blackbeard Suite. And it's just a large, fab, master bedroom, again with more patios overlooking the pool. Um, beautiful little bathroom. Completely redone. Large closet um, just down the hall. Next door we come to the Ahoy Suite which again is just another charming, also an unsweet suite. So um, a similar bath and also a pool view. Continue down the hall, we come to Shipwreck Suite. Shipwreck Suite is kind of a dual multi-purpose room. Um, it could be a hangout, it has a fold-out couch, also uh, doubles as an office if somebody needs some office space. Next door to the shipwreck suite, there is a large bathroom which doubles as a powder room um, and a bath for shipwreck. Get out of the main house at Pirate Point, across the way we come to Treasure Suite, which it's, it is its own private suite here on the Pirate Point property charming room with everything you need, private patio, gorgeous views, uh, large closet, unsweet bath, and who doesn't want to hang out here? Your suite is one of two laundry facilities, washer, dryer, folding table, laundry baskets, everything you need. The last part of Pirate Point is Sea Dog House. And this again is a private suite. This one um, is a little bit more as far as living. You have a living room and a kitchenette. All kinds of nooks here to spend time. You have a second laundry facility, ironing board, iron, laundry table, and one of my favorites, which is the Parrot Head Suite. As you come in around the corner from Parrot Head, you have more closets and again, a private bath. So y'all, Pirate Point is definitely a place to visit, 
a place to spend some time and we can't wait for you to get here. Well, it's just before sunset and we're making the rounds at Pirate Point just to see the grounds, the outdoor seating areas and patios. Big canal, deep open water. Coco Plum is really cool. They have all of these um, mangroves and channels that you can uh, go through on paddle boards and kayaks. It's really like your own private aquarium. Um, but the boating from here is also fantastic. Really great water access. Um, and like I said, there's just about no limitation as far as the size of boat that you bring. So there's a fish cleaning station with a tiki hut for shade, a little seed sitting area, and um, as you can see, lots and lots of room for your boats. Um, there is a little outdoor shower, a great pool. Ooh, that's cool. The pool, you'll see we have a grill and um, nice seating areas whether you want to get in the pool or just sit out and keep people company that are in there. Um, patios and landscaping and lots of comfortable places to sit and dine.